Special thanks to Skillshare for sponsoring today's video. Skillshare is an online learning community for creatives where millions come together to take the next step in their creative journey. Now, as a busy mom, I like that most of their classes are under 60 minutes with short lessons. I'm actually taking a productivity class called Real Productivity, Create Your Ideal Week. Uh, and that's by Michael, who's the founder of Skillshare. I love Skillshare because it is curated specifically for learning, meaning that there are no ads and they are always launching new premium classes so you can stay focused and follow wherever your creativity takes you. The best thing about this guys is that it's less than $10 a month with an annual subscription. Now Skillshare was kind enough to offer a, a trial of their premium membership to the first thousand people who click on the link in my description box so if you're looking to explore your creativity now is the time guys click on the link in, in my description box and head on over to skillshare to try out their premium membership i know you're gonna love it what's up guys welcome back to another video it's your girl fit martini and in today's video i am going to be doing a get it all done with me video so i am sharing with you my um well breakfast right now i'm actually making breakfast it is sunday morning the boys actually spent the night at their dad's house um so i ended up kind of sleeping in today so i'm just making breakfast and then um i'm just gonna watch church at home today so um i'm just gonna share that with you so this is gonna be more of a get it all done with me video so everything from no prepping uh going to the gym shopping grocery haul um and then uh going to pick up the boys in the evening so so yeah as i said before i just got started by making breakfast and i'm just making myself some eggs and uh, i've been really enjoying this um I, I don't know what you would call it like stir fry or whatever where i just mix um green and red peppers and then i mix some sausage in there um and then eggs and it just tastes so good And then now I just uh, take the time to listen to the preaching while I eat my breakfast. And then after this, I usually will just clean up and head over to the gym. Now, I kind of, there are some times when I will do fasted uh, workouts, so I don't uh, eat before I work out. But there are other times when I do eat before I work out because I know that I'm going to be doing a lot of um strength training so um that's pretty much why i decided to have my breakfast before i went to the gym plus i kind of woke up a little later um than i wanted to but this is just my summer notes guys and then i'm just gonna get into cleaning um and then after that i'm just gonna head over to the gym uh for a quick workout
So when it comes to my workouts, um, I do not like doing cardio. Like I just hate it. I am not a big fan. I like um, heat, so high intensity workouts, uh, but more so I prefer strength training more than anything. So whenever I go to the gym, I always have to lift some weights. Um, I am getting much more serious now about my weight loss. I definitely want to lose this weight already. Uh, it's definitely taking me a long, longer than I wanted um, to actually lose it. But I'm definitely getting a lot more serious on it. I'm probably going to be setting another YouTube channel just for fitness, but I wanted to share it here with you guys. But yeah, I just did some back um, because my back has definitely been hurting a bit. Uh, so I just did some back and cardio today. And then I just headed over to Walmart to go get some shopping done. As you guys, so you know how it is when you say, I'm just gonna go to Walmart for like a few things, or I'm just gonna go get a few things, and then you end up with a hundred things. That is what happened to me today. I was like, okay, I'm just gonna go shop for a few things, and then I come out with every single thing that was there. But I wanted to show you what I bought um, before I start my meal prep and go take a shower and whatnot. So I got this hand soap from Miss Myers. I really like Miss Myers, and I love this scent. I bought some whipping cream, some parsnips, um, this gel from Cantu. I've never actually tried this before, so I wanted to try it. And then I saw this book and I, I had to get it. Uh, it says, God gave us Christmas. So I'm gonna read that to the boys today when they come back. And then I bought this banana nut muffin mix. I bought two of those, I'm gonna make those today. Got some couscous. Um, some peanut butter larabas. I love larabas, so I'm gonna try the peanut butter ones. I've never had those before. And then I got the a mixed fruit smoothie, uh, some bananas, uh, baby spinach, and then I got this mixed nut. Which this one has peanuts, almonds, cashews, hazelnuts, and uh, pecans. And then I got some walnuts for the baking, some brown rice. Some granny apples. I got this salad kit. This one has kale. It's a kale pecan cranberry. So I want to try that this evening. And then I bought some garlic, um, some mandarins, and uh, potatoes, sweet potatoes. Um, I got some plastic wrap, parchment paper, pears, um, cherry tomatoes. Um, this Welch's passion fruits. I really like the passion fruit. 
Um, and then I also got this uh, rice cakes. I love to eat this with avocado and I completely forgot to buy avocado. So <laughs> I'm gonna have to go get that, but I like to, eat, to add avocado to this. And then I got some salmon, some shrimp, um, some more apples, some, um, gosh, why is this <laughs> not coming to me? Um, some cheese and uh, corn and that's pretty much it yeah so it was a quick trip i wanted to just go for a few things and then i came out with everything so um i'm gonna go ahead and <laughs> uh put this away get started with meal prepping i still have to do a few things <laughs> so let's go ahead and get that i remember the day when we started talking we were kids and i knocked down all of your marbles but you did not seem to mind at all We took our bikes to the lake after school each day And skipped many stones from the beach And one thing you said was listen Change a bit in my heart Your words have never been wrong You are my own safety zone You're solid like a granite stone Now that everything has been put away, I am moving on to meal prepping. And today I'm only making one dish, which is just gonna be a, a shrimp stir fry with roasted veggies. So I'm just gonna be preparing that here. Um, and then I'm also going to be baking some uh, muffins and uh, banana loaf. So I'm just gonna share that with you here. I'm not really gonna talk much through this because it's mostly self-explanatory, but um, yeah, I was kind of running out of time, so I couldn't really do um, a lot of different dishes here. Plus, this was like the week um, before Thanksgiving, so I felt like I didn't really have to make that much. So um, I just ended up doing as, um, as little as possible. Now that those are in the oven, I'm just gonna bake, uh, and I'm actually baking cupcakes or muffins rather, um, blueberry, banana muffins, blueberry, cinnamon, banana muffins. <laughs> I just had to add everything in there. Um, so I decided to just use the store bought mix. My kids are here, so just in case you hear noises or sa or you know little sounds, it's it's them. <laughs> But I decided to do the store bought uh, banana nut mix because, you know, I just wanted to make this as easy as possible for me because uh, today I just had a lot to do. Um, so I just mixed up one of them uh, so that I can make the, bun the uh, muffins. And so once that was in the oven then i also did the other one and i just wanted to make the other one um a loaf of bread so i did that and i placed it in the oven as well now once those ones were in the oven then i started actually sa sauteing my um shrimp and so i'm just cooking the shrimp right now and i just added some garlic to it 
and after that I decided to add some turmeric and salt and that was pretty much it for the um, for the shrimp da, da, da. Okay, so now that uh, the shrimp is cooked, I just decided to kind of make a little bit of a, I guess, a sauce or stew. I don't know how you would call this, but I just mixed some uh, some um, onions and then added some tomatoes to that. And then I'm just adding Royco, which is a Kenyan spice uh, mixed to that um to those two and then I also added some mushrooms here and spinach now gosh I really need to get like acquainted with all of this baking and cooking terms because <laughs> I want to cook more on this channel but sometimes I'm just like how do you, what do you call this is it is this a stir fry or is it uh, is I don't know just tell me in the comments what you would call this because I am like at a loss for words English is not my first language of course um, but still <laughs> I should be able to know what what it is when you're cooking this in on this top top but that is done so now I just uh, added that as the base for my spinach um, and then I added the spinach on top of that and also the roasted veggies and that was pretty much it for the meal for this week. Um, now, I know some people are like, oh, this is just one dish that you're going to eat for the whole week. No, um, I will be cooking as well and this is going to be divided between me and my kids and it's going to be... Um, it probably like two days worth of food is is here um so we definitely that de we definitely add variety into this but just having some meal prepared really helps for me and so once that was done then i took out all of my um i took out the muffins from their little uh silicone uh holders i bought this um I, I bought this thing i gosh words are not coming to me today i bought this from i believe it, it was ross and the silicone are reusable uh silicone cup ho cupcake holders so i really like that and then my loaf was done at this point so i like how this turned out honestly i i like the store bought um because it just makes it a lot easier to to do this especially when you're running behind of things <laughs> and then after that i just prepared my smoothie for the week which is i just added uh bananas and mixed berries and um mango and pineapple and all those other good stuff i usually make this pretty much every week it, i have this um, smoothie and it's a great alternative to eating or as just as a snack Okay, it's literally a mess here because I just shipped everything everywhere, but <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm gonna clean this up. <laughs> so I need to show you the berry, the fruits, the smoothie for this week. Once I finished everything, then I just headed over to go pick up the boys. And that was it for today's video, guys. If you did enjoy it, leave me a like and a comment down below. And I'll be seeing you on the next video. Thank you so much for watching this, and I hope you have a great day. So, what's the story behind? Mountain you're trying to climb Think of her